Another vision. The Force is guiding us, helping us retrace the steps of Malak and his old master, leading us ever closer to the Star Forge. Kashek is a lush but simple and undeveloped world. I would not have expected to find the alien technology of a star map here. The Wookiees of Kashek make their home high among the Rosha branches. Only the bravest warriors dare to descend into the forbidding depths of the forest. If the star map is located far beneath us on the planet's surface, as our vision seems to suggest, it's unlikely the Wookiees even know of its existence. No doubt things will become more clear once we discover the star map's location. Oof. <laughs> 
Sepedan Delva Mori Sidan Delva Tuhi Tuh Lapan Nibu Delva Mori Sidan Delva Bagi Nogan Delva Tuhi Tuh Lapan Nibu Delva Mori Sidan Delva Bagi Nogan Delva Siapa yang beri satu pedaan debat? Rendungkas! Kudas dan siapa? Kudas dan Chris! Siapa yang beri satu pedaan debat? Kudas dan siapa? Kudas dan Chris! Kudas dan siapa? No problem. Got it. No problem. Got it. Just come to pass me, mo. Chi ita kangi chan na kiri kon? Kimba muli ra bona ji. Kimba no kumikset abom. Kiwi aita ka tong kicha. Agi uko kiwa e aita kang kicha na yuk. Kiwi aita ka tong kicha. Agi uko une kuna muli ra. Tangi wama jiko na. Tong kipa no kumik abom. Achua penki. Yun patis. Kaki Chiwi aita ka tong chicha Agi uko tune chuna muli ra Tangi wama jiko na chiwa ka aita kang chicha na chukor nibo Baba Iku kuno no ba muli ra chikun Tong hit kun chun ching, ne bo bo je mata de pun nage. Dolpi kikiu ana, je do ba do wana ni di bo bo. Tong ngabung sha ni nunya, tong patukas mak talaya. Ronda di ho tonga kun hongka bi. Wana kun bez ching palamule tong king ba nunotek. Tuk ning cha tu kun ne mule rabes. Takum jus tak miki grabul mogo. Kacicu ita bodunga. Tolba bank wale oganda naru chuchut. Mogi sha punga bola wana chik ne. Ba mule slimo puda da da nanga kum bist mule rabes. Ka chi kun ita hodunga. Ye king kuno ba mule ra chi kun. Slimo podo na rundi hodunga ku. Tong hai tuam jiji jum lumpa ni tapu e tiki tu dolpa da bongwale o gandona chuchut kachi chu ita dun donga yuma lita kuto dun jila mula ne ni du bobo onga kumbis jang ba mule ra ta kumjus tak miki grabul mogo kachi chu ita bo dunga. Tolba bank, wale o ganda na lu chuchut. Mogi siya punga, bola wana chik ne. Pa mule slimo, puta da da nanga kumbist, mule rabest. Ka chikun ita hodonga, ikin kuno ba mule ra chikun. Slimo puto na rundi hodonga kunga be. Runda di hodonga kunga be. Wana kun bez ching palamule tung king ba nunotek Tung ning cha tu kun ne mule rabes Ka chi kun ita hodonga Ye king kuno ba mule ra chi kun Slimo po do na rundi hodunga ku hunka be Runda di hotonga kun hongka bi 
One kun bez ching palamule tungking ba nunutek tuk nin chetukun mule rabes ka chikun ida hodonga yikin kuno ba mule ra chikun slimo podonar undi hodunga ku hunkabe mucho shak pakhat ki achuta Unga kun bis dolpi kikuyana tong patugas maktelea To you. Something I can get for you? Kindly direct your inquiries to me. Martin is merely an indebted employee. His opinions don't amount to much. So, new spaces have come to Wild Kashik. Please, look well upon the wares of Eli Gand. I live to serve your needs. Just be sure to pay cash. The interest on his loans will drain you like a diluvian fatworm on a hut's backside. First off, hearts are all backside. Secondly, I don't much like the comparison. No need to get personal. It's just business. Poor fellow. He's been waiting for his friends to return with my money for a standard month now. Ah, but you don't need to hear this. What can I get you? Enslave? I resent that. Simply fair business. This man's fellow's left without settling their debts, so he must make up the difference. I know, I know, it's standard trading rules. I just want to know where my crew went. I was only gone for two days. This isn't like them. Yes, very sad that they would abandon you, especially while you were doing me a favor and helping repair one of my freighters. Something about this whole situation stinks worse than an overcrowded Ronto stable. What kind of friends would just abandon a crewmate? You think you know someone and they turn out to be a cheat. Oh, not like you, Matt. You honor your deals. A word is a bond in trade. Oh, it isn't about the amount. After all, as a skilled mechanic, Matten is worth much more than what is owed, especially on this remote planet. Oh, you flatter me, Eli. I guess we're best buddies now. <clears throat> as I was saying, it's a matter of principle. 
I'm nothing if not honest in my dealings, and I demand the same. He'll be free to go when his friends turn up and the debt is paid. I honor my deals. Let no one say otherwise. Thanks, but no thanks. No offense, but there's no point exchanging debt to Eli with debt to you. Besides, he is a hard worker. I'd prefer to keep him. Uh, it happens from time to time. Credits are scarce out here, and not everyone is as honest as Mr. Dasel here. You'll get your money. My crew will be back. Of course they will. Until then, however, I can make use of you as a mechanic. Very rare to find skills of your kind out here. Of course. I'm here to serve. I don't concern myself with what goes on past this landing port. The walkies are... Mm, very difficult to deal with. No business sense. You mean they don't tolerate cheats? No. I mean they don't respect the finer points of a good business plan. Give and take. That's why the Zerk Corporation simply takes. You'd have to take your question to the Zerk Corporation. And the walkies themselves. I keep to myself. Of course. I'm here to serve. Of course. You're in a hurry. Welcome to Adia. I trust you will find our facilities pass inspection. Zerka Corporation is very efficient. I'm sorry, I don't understand Wookie speak. Shiri Wook, I think it's called. What did the Wookie say? Zerka Corporation calls the planet Adia, and no, I don't understand the language. The local Wookie leader has made it so we don't need to. Wookies are unable to speak basic. But for the last decade, the residents of all local villages have been trained to understand it. I understand he works very closely with Zerka Corporation. He wants his people to work well with us. It eases tensions. What did he say? I don't usually have a translator I can ask. I just work here in the lab. I... I don't have anything to do with the taking of slaves. I don't have to justify myself to you. I do good work here. If you're looking for trouble, go somewhere else. I'm conducting experiments on various samples of indigenous plant life. There may be untapped pharmaceutical resources here. Of course, that will take some time, and the Wookiees are a more immediate source of income. Please, I must return to my work. I'm sorry, but Director Chanos will see to your questions. I must continue my work. I'm conducting experiments on very... of... Farewell. Oh, 
God. He endured it all, and when he could, he offered to me. something about your breath. I didn't want to say anything, but it's bad. Worse than usual, which is hard to believe. In fact, now that I think about it, your breath has been pretty rancid ever since we rescued you from those Gamorian slavers. What'd they feed you, buddy? <coughs> oh, Zalbar, that's terrible. I know how grouchy you get if you don't get your eight square meals a day. I'm amazed you didn't pass out from hunger. Ew! No wonder your breath is so bad, Big Z. Good morning, smell like bantha poodoo. We'll have to pick you up a toothbrush to clean that stench out of your choppers. Okay, relax. No toothbrush. Sheesh. Just try and eat something else to cover up that smell, okay? Stay away from anything that's smart enough to lock you in a cage this time. <laughs> Hold here, Spacer. Zerka Corporation doesn't recommend traveling in Wild Adean. 
Katarn attacks are especially bad right now. Wookiee hunters usually keep numbers down, but I think they leave certain areas infested, just hoping a Zerka guard will get killed. You're the Wookiee lover? Why don't you tell me about them? I'm sure you're real close friends. Keep your pet on a leash, or you'll be wearing him. I have no love for these animals. I've seen guards ripped to shreds. <laughs> Not anymore. Look, you want to know why the Wookiees are acting compliant? You go ask them. When they rip your head off, we'll fish it out of the Shadowlands and give it a proper burial. How about that? I don't talk to Wookiee lovers. Get rid of your rug, and maybe I won't have you shot. I won't stop you, but you leave this area at your own risk. We're here to protect the company, not you. What they get for a healthy one of those things? We'll work it out later. We've got company. What do you want, Spacer? I'm Patrol Captain Denno, and you're interrupting Zerka Corporation business. This Wookiee slave got a little rebellious. We had to put it down. <laughs> now. That growl sounded pretty threatening. Keep your slave on its leash or we'll have another accident. Just shut up, you trigger-happy idiot. Of course they don't. Why would you ask me that? You're doing some sort of snap inspection? You're trying to get me to admit to incompetence, aren't you? Not going to happen. I stand by my patrol. This Wookiee got out of hand and had to be put down. We'll find another easy enough. 
Is that a joke? Who do you think you are? I, uh, I think I should pull in some favors and get us moved off-world, then. Uh, are you all right, Captain? Are you questioning my orders? You don't want to do that. If... if you say so, Captain. Yes, I say so. Move out. This place just isn't worth the trouble. Yes? Yeah. <laughs> 
gray strands starting to poke through. <laughs> Don't worry, Big Z. It's nothing I can't fix. A little trim, a splash of coloring, and you'll be as good as new. Best looking Wookiee on the planet. Maybe a nice suit. I know, Wookiees aren't into the whole clothing thing, but you could start a whole new trend. You'd be on the cutting edge. Okay, okay, sheesh. Try to offer some constructive criticism and this is the thanks I get? Let's move on. You can just stay naked and scruffy for all I care. No problem. Didn't work. What? Gotcha. Darn it. What? Oh, <laughs> <laughs> 
Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Whoever steps on this will get a nasty shock. Yes? was most displeased when he learned you had escaped Taris alive. He has promised a great reward to whoever destroys you. Oops. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> 
out of here. You can count on us. Oh, 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 oh. 
It isn't an easy language to learn, what with all the growls and howls. Big Z told me the whole point was to make it difficult for outsiders to understand. this on my own. I need the aid of others, especially one who is strong in the Force. The bond between us made you a natural choice. Besides, the events on Taurus proved that the Force wanted to bring us together for this mission. 
And there is little left to chance when the force is involved. Is that not enough for you? I said we were brought together for our mission, to stop Malak. I hardly think the Force would be pushing us toward a romantic involvement when the fate of the galaxy is at stake. Please try to stay focused. I doubt the Council would approve if they knew we were busy discussing our mutual attraction when we should be saving the galaxy from Malak. Mutual attraction? I never said... It's just an expression. Whatever our feelings... I mean, whatever your feelings, you have to try to ignore them. Don't let this complicate things. Finding the missing pieces of the star maps is our only hope of locating the Star Forge and defeating Malak. The Council explained all this quite clearly. I admit, there were times that I wondered if this is more than just a mission to stop Malak. There were times when I wondered if this was also a way for the Council to test my own abilities. I wondered if the Council wanted to see how I would help and guide you on our quest. I wondered if they were testing me to see if I was ready to become a Jedi Master myself. And then I realized how foolish such thoughts were. As the Council explained, sending a Master in our group would only have drawn unwanted attention from the Sith. The fate of the galaxy is at stake. The Council would not risk it merely to test me. They calculated the risks, and in the end chose the only option available. You must learn to trust in the wisdom of the Council. Your destiny will come when it's appointed time. You mustn't be so impatient. Must you be so frustrating? I admit, I had a moment of foolish pride, but I'm over it. Now I am focused on my true responsibilities. I'm simply trying to help you and complete this mission, and yet you battle me at every turn. I started it. You were the one who brought up the issue of the Council. You were the one who questioned our mission. You were the one who mocked me for thinking I was being tested. You, you are a very odd man. Do you know that? I simply don't know how to deal with you. All I want to do is help you, but you seem determined to drive me mad. Unfortunately, it isn't as easy as that, but your point is well taken. Come on, come, let's move on. There's much to be done. Ah! <laughs> 
once told me he had seen paradise destroyed by the greed of outsiders. I never understood what he meant until now. Thank <laughs> you. 
can I do? Crawling beasts are hiding in the underbrush. I'm Jolie. Jolie Bindo. Follow me to my camp and we'll talk about it. Ah, don't start fawning just yet. I'm too old for you. Uh, I, I know a few things. We can talk about it. Keep close. It's nearby under the log. Yeah, I live like some burrowing bird. I fought the Sith. Now look at me. Pull up a stump and be comfortable. We should discuss a few things.
Don't coddle me, child. I'm neither a Jedi nor your master. I'm just an old man that's been lost in the woods for far too long. My days of glory are behind me, but perhaps there is something I can do for you. You must have questions. What is there to tell? Jolie Bindo is the crazy old man in the dangerous woods. I'm content with the impression I give. I follow the Jedi way and I command the Force, yes. I suppose that makes me as much a Jedi as anyone, but what of it? Why should being what I am compel me to entertain others with tales of the good old days? Ah, I've seen my share of the dark and the light. And frankly, both extremes annoy me. Of course, I have felt rumblings of change. It's kind of nice to meet a Jedi who isn't all hung up on this light side, dark side stuff. It gets pretty tiring, you know? Perhaps you'll be of some assistance to me after all. Let us discuss what you came here for. <sighs> fine, fine. Yes, among the Wookiees. Intriguing creatures. I like that they have little patience for bureaucrats. But of course, even here, there are hidden things that manipulate. Circa Corporation was smart to put him in power. He's as good at destroying Wookiee culture as dropping corpses full of Ardroxian flu. Will you work for him or against him, I wonder? I will be interested to see. Uh, sure. How's this? Think for yourself. I don't care for politics. I'm big on letting people figure things out for themselves. The Wookiees have prophecies of deliverance if you ask them. But for now, they follow without hesitation. That is their wish. Madden with grief, perhaps, but not crazed. I helped him pass to the lower forest where only a Wookiee could follow. Some other matters will determine if you can follow. There is a barrier that, well, we'll talk about that more in a moment. It is a very unfortunate matter. It will end in shame and sorrow. You will find roar war down here, and more. I've witnessed a number of happenings, but I've left them for others to sort out. I wasn't aware I had to be. Look, events like these reveal much about the people involved. I'm well past that introspective tripe. I'm not saying that outside help isn't needed, I just... well... I didn't want to make anyone mad while I didn't have a way off the planet. We'll talk more about that momentarily. <sighs> now why would you be asking about that, hmm? Don't answer. I knew that had to be why you were here. The problems of a few Wookiees don't amount to anything before the concerns of the Jedi. No. Kashyyyk is an interesting place, more so than anyone suspects. If Circa Corporation knew, the planet would be a strip mine. The Wookiees have their legends that they were not always here. But it is more than that. The trees themselves are strangers. What I'm saying is that there are literally walls in your way. And you won't find what you need without my help. And my help has a price. You must do a task for me and then allow me to join with you. I will then remove certain barriers in your path. Oh, save it. I know this sounds absurd, but I'm old and entitled to work you around a bit. Besides, the test is simple. Since they began expanding in the Shadowlands, the Circa have left me alone for the most part. Until recently, anyway. A group of them set up camp not far from here. Poachers is all they are. I'd like them removed from this place. They are not that far northeast of here. There's usually five in the area, as far as I can see. The captain of the lot is the one that earned my ire. Mishandle my garden, Willie. <laughs> you presumably have a ship. I've seen all I wish to here. Isn't that enough? I mean, I'm really sick of the trees. And perhaps your destiny might show me something new. You never know. They don't respect this place. 
They are butchering wildlife and threatening entire species. It's getting under my skin. The Wookiees could take care of themselves. But the animals are truly helpless victims. Yes, yes, I'm an old man that's getting fussy. Call me foolish if you will, I don't care, you still have to do it. Their camp is in the far northeast. Now remember, if I wanted them dead, I'd have done it myself. Find a better way. Good. Return to me here and we'll see how you have done. Shoo! Shoo! Malfunction. My primary motivators are in good position. Error. Damage terminal. Playback calls. Playback. When he gets back, we'll... Wait, I'm getting something. Oh good, it's Eli. Maybe he'll point us in the right direction. Playback. Eli, what are you... You got your money, you double-crossing snake. We had a deal. Playback. I don't get it. That merchant said there was salvage down here. We need Matten to work the sensors. Playback. When he gets back, we'll... Wait, I'm getting something. Oh good, it's Eli. Maybe he'll point us in the right direction. Playback. Eli, what are you... You got your money, you double-crossing snake. We had a deal. Malfunction. Playback. Playback. When he gets back, we'll... Wait, I'm getting something. Oh, playback.
Civil merchant like that coral slime up on the docking ring? This is my territory. I don't make deals, and I don't persuade easily, so go back topside. Mess with my profits and I'll see you dead. That crazy old fool is still alive. I suppose he's still upset that we don't all live in little homemade shacks like he chooses. I've got a job to do here, and there's nothing you or that old coot can do about it. If you made it this far, you know a fair bit. What would I be able to tell you? What? No, I don't do much. It's too much of a headache. I'm in the business of harvesting animals. Some of the more exotic species have organs that can be removed for some surprising applications. Talk to me about work, and maybe I'll tell you more. If you made it this far, you Besides you? Besides any number of predators that can kill in seconds? I suppose there's old Bin. He's got a camp here somewhere. I'd leave him alone there. Anyone who'd live down here is just plain crazy. There's not much else. We've got a repulsor field to the east, so I'm not much passes from here now. It's not worth it. You're fighting the plants as well as the animals. Kashi vines are tough as metal and grow back fast. Instead, head office installed repulsor fields to keep the big predators out. Permanent placements, too. We'll be fine for you. <laughs> Hurry up, you're eating into my prop. <laughs> Is that old hermit Jolie trying to talk you into doing his dirty work? We've spent too much on setting up just to walk away. As long as the sonic emitters keep the Preds away and I've got bodies to guard the perimeter, we're staying right here. I mean, if I can put up with my own worthless guards complaining about this place, Joe Lee whining through you is nothing. I don't need this kind of garbage from you. Watch your mouth. I'm the only law there is down here. If you have something to say, get on with it. Otherwise, leave me alone. I've credits to it. I'm not down here to direct traffic. No problem. Didn't work. No problem. Got it. What? Gotcha. 
anything, you'll have to talk to the commander. He's in charge of our harvesting here. Why am I here? I'm here because this is where the commander told me to stand. And that's all there is to it. I'm just a guard for this emitter. Why couldn't they have just equipped this lump of tech with a blaster and left me at home? I'm not here because I know stuff. I handle a blaster well enough to guard this emitter and that's it. Talk to the commander. They generate a sonic barrier that allows us to stay in this wonderful location. It keeps the big predators away. I don't know how it works, really. I just know that if they go down, the camp would be overrun. What of it? I don't like being here, that's for sure. I suppose you could take this code and shut down the emitter I'm guarding. Enough of those emitters go down and the camp will have to move out. But I never said anything. You want anything, you'll have to talk to the commander. He's in charge of our harvesting here. Why am I here? I'm here because this is where the commander told me to stand. And that's all there is to it. I'm just a guard for this emitter. Why couldn't they have just equipped this lump of tech with a blaster and left me at home? What do you want to know about that? It's just one of five or so sonic emitters protecting the camp. I don't like being here, that's for sure. I suppose you could take this code and shut down the emitter I'm guarding. Enough of those emitters go down, and the camp will have to move out. But I never said anything. What? Run! Run! Welcome back! I wonder, much luck, have you done as I asked? Yes, I could feel it as you walked near, and I don't sense the smell of death on you. You spared them. Interesting. Wasn't there? I suppose not that the environment would say otherwise if it could talk. I know where you want to go. I can get you through to the old paths. This place has done some strange things. There's also a Circa Repulsor field blocking the way, past the poacher camp in the east. I saw it when it was installed, so I know how to pass it. And on the other side, ancient answers. And perhaps a Wookiee you are seeking. I hope it's in the mood for visitors.
At least compared to the other Zerka equipment dumped out here. It's only been here a short while, or the Wookiees would have disabled it. They wouldn't have had an easy time of it, though. But there are others, each blocking similar points on certain paths. It is all very calculated, very precise. It would have been effective if it hadn't relied on the creatures to be walking. Climbers don't have much trouble getting out. Manipulated for a moment. Uh, let me see. How did the Zerg engineers do it? Ah, there we go. Now, keep moving. These are the most dangerous depths of Kashik. A few surprises wait for us, I'll wager. Let's see what you got. 
Friends, don't you remember me? his pursuers lose him. Do you remember me now, Freya? Oh. 
外。Detected. Determining parameters. Initiating neural recognition. Yes, there's the thing. Obstinate machine. I've no doubt it holds what you seek. But good luck getting it operational. Primary neural recognition complete. Preliminary match found. Match found? What the? It always muttered something about rejected patterns for me. Begin socialized interface. Awaiting instruction. Greetings. This terminal has not been accessed for quite some time. Error. Subject displays unfamiliarity to environment. Behavioral reconfiguration will be needed before access. I am sorry. I did not mean to confuse you. I will answer questions to the best of my programming limitations. I have been programmed with a very limited field of knowledge, and I must restrict access to only those that fit my allowed pattern. Accessing? Yes, I have found a star map in original system memory. Access is restricted. Error. Data regarding author of the star map is corrupted. I have been programmed with a very limited field of knowledge, and I must restrict access to only those that fit my allowed pattern. I can't say. I will try to bring forward the behavior that you need to proceed, as outlined by my programming. I can't say. Preliminary matching allows for you to be coached. I can't say. Likelihood of restriction by previous user, 100%. I utilize a retro-adapted holocron interface. Clarify your questions, and I will attempt to access original system memory. Error. Corruption. Extrapolating. This utility was built to monitor planet-wide agricultural reformation. It has since malfunctioned. It can be theorized that the supergrowth of Kashyyyk forests is a direct result. Well, that is surprising. I doubt any Wookiee would support such a claim. The forest is millennia old. Malfunction occurred 241 years after last builder communication. Last builder communication 29,642 years before current Republic standard. Error. Information regarding the builders of this installation has been corrupted. No evidence of such a civilization exists in the galactic record. Error. Records corrupted. It can be theorized that bioseeding allowed the ecology to remain balanced. It could be expected that the same energy feeding the trees of Kashyyyk also accelerated the evolution of various species. No further information is available. There is too much corrupted data. 
Accessing. I will answer as my programming permits. This interface was installed to better access the ancient data stored within the pre-existing system. The exact date is unavailable. Programming keys indicate no earlier than five years before current Republic standard. Five years ago? I didn't notice it. This must have been installed in strictest secrecy. Couldn't have been circa. No other information on time of installation or identity of user available. Likelihood of removal by user, 100%. Sorting by identity. Three attempts by the Wookiee Freyer, all denied. 152 attempts by human Jolie Bindo, all denied. <laughs> Call me stubborn, I guess. There wasn't much else to do around here. Error. List of access attempts prior to these is corrupted. Likelihood of removal by user, 100%. Error. Data regarding subject, Revan, corrupted. Answer will be given within the limits of my programming limitations. Accessing. Your request requires additional... Si there are measures available with that. Information unavailable. If you have further questions, ask them now. Access will terminate with success or failure of evaluation. Evaluation commencing. Result will be compared against the pattern in memory. Just act like you should. You travel with a Wookiee and have encountered complications. Hypothetical. You and this Zalbar are captured and separated. If you both remain silent, one year in prison for each of you. However, call Zalbar a traitor and he will serve five years while you serve none. He is offered the same deal. But if you both accuse the other, you both serve two years. What do you do? What do you trust him to do? Are you sure? If you turn, you risk two years, or none at all. If you reply on loyalty, you risk one year, or five. Your loyalty is dangerous. Your companion could take the opportunity to benefit by turning on you. Zalbar's family is mired in treachery. What loyalty do they know? Your answer is incorrect. You cannot refuse. Evaluation must continue. You must match the pattern in memory. Your memory. I must demand honest acceptance of the proper behavior. That is a condition of my programming. The previous incorrect response will be discounted. Future incorrect responses will result in rejection. Hypothetical. You are at war. Deciphering an intercepted code. You learn two things about your enemy. A single spot in their defense will be at its weakest in 10 days, and they will attack one of your cities in 5 days. What do you do with this information? What is the most efficient course of action? And in so doing, alert the enemy to their broken codes. They would know that their weakness was exposed. They would reinforce, and the war would go on. You save thousands at the expense of victory. You do not match the pattern in memory. Subject has failed to demonstrate the required behavior. Access denied. This system will purge the subject as false. Defense mode initiated. I still... I still...
Initial assumptions about you were incorrect. Secondary scans during battle have revealed much. Under duress, your emotions were easier to read. Programming now instructs that I give you what you seek. That information is not available. Soon you will recognize the proper course to follow. The star map is yours. This unit has now completed its primary duty and has finished with the subject. Executing final action. Activation of star map commencing. Parameters reset. Stasis initiated. And communication. Star map, an ancient artifact of dark side power. Can't say I'm surprised. I always knew there was something funny down here. I wonder if the star map has had an effect on the evolution of the creatures here in the Shadowlands. It might explain why it's so dangerous down here. An interesting theory, but I suppose we don't have time to test it now, do we? Now that we've got what you came for, we should be heading back up to the treetops.
Yes?
Way to go, Big Z!
Yours? Why would we find your casing beside... No, it couldn't be, could it? <sighs> this will end in sadness. Don't say I didn't warn you. seem like the right path to follow, but you do not know these people as I do. Mmm. 
Thank you. 